How many adults and children will be tested before the vaccine is available to the general population? I don't know the exact numbers, but there will be testing on adults, testing on children, and uh, testing on uh, pregnant women uh, to make sure that, again, we have a safe vaccine. Now, Katie, this is a vaccine that is going to be very similar to seasonal flu vaccine, and we know that millions of children, millions of adults, pregnant women take seasonal flu vaccine year in and year out. The strain is a little bit different, but our scientists have determined that this virus is reacting very much like seasonal flu. Will adjuvants or additives be used in some batches of this vaccine to make it more potent? At this point, that is not anticipated. Now, if things change, if we don't find the immunities uh, boosted enough by the dosage, if we somehow have a mutation uh, of the vaccine, it's possible that adjuvants will be used to both boost the um, reaction, the body's reaction to the vaccine, and also to stretch the vaccine further. But right now, it's not anticipated that we will be using adjuvant in this seasonal flu vaccine. Will you be recommending that Tamiflu be used prophylactically or preventatively to keep the flu from spreading? All the doctors I've talked to, Katie, say that um, that is not a wise use of these antivirals. The good news is the antivirals seem to be effective against this strain of H1N1 virus. Uh, but taking it ahead of getting sick is not recommended. We want to make sure that, you know, Tamiflu and Relenza are not just taken. It doesn't really help you, and it may actually reduce uh, your resistance to the flu if you start taking it now. How much concern do you have that this virus could possibly mutate and become even more dangerous? Well, right now, as you know, Katie, in the southern hemisphere, they are in the middle of seasonal flu and H1N1 virus. So we're, we have teams on the ground in South America and Central America, in Australia, watching very carefully. And so far, uh, there is not a mutation of the virus. And if it changes, uh, the whole uh, protocol for what vaccine will be effective changes with it. Secretary of Health and Human Services Kathleen Sebelius, thank you so much for talking with us tonight.